You guys, at this point, eh, I can just tell you guys in confidence that Lee Kwon is the owner of Nengi's gigantic Ikibi. Like, <laughs> I don't know how to explain it to you guys, but Lee Kwon has possession of Nengi's backside. Nengi's backside that nobody, nobody, not even Ozo, can come close to. You see Lee Kwon, tiny Lee Kwon. <laughs> Lee Kwon is in control of it because the way Lee Kwon rocks Nengi's backside, in fact, immediately he hears music. The backside just belongs to him, and Nengi on her own knows for sure that it is Lekon that owns her backside. Where once the music comes on, because she doesn't go to anyone else for what even for the things she does with Lekon, she just goes straight to Lekon, and Lekon takes possession of it automatically. Hello, guys, welcome so back again to my channel. Please, if you're seeing me for the very first time, hi, my name is Vicky, and please consider to hit on that red subscribe button, subscribing to my channel, and do not forget to turn on your notification bell. So that YouTube will inform you whenever I post a new video. And please guys, check me out on my lifestyle channel. The link is always in the description and pinned in the comment section. Oh, guys, hmm. last night was, I don't know if I would say, I would say that's the last pool party. Of course, yeah, that would be the last party or the last flex scene in the jacuzzi in the house. And the housemates, they had a feel of it, you get. And Lekon and Nengi we are the center of the shoe because Lekon, ah, I don't even know how to explain to you guys because at this point it weak me, it shock me, joy, it tire me, and I, I don't even know how to tell her again. But this is what Lekon was literally doing to Nengi. <laughs> Shokuna, it's Shokuna because Nengi, Nengi, no, even like she's not ashamed, she's she cared less, she's she just freestyles with Lekon. And I can remember the Maxine, even also in his interview, that ah, we see the way Lekon takes possession of Nengi's backside. How does he feel about it? And also was like, Lekon is who he is when he's, he drinks, he doesn't think about anything anymore, but he doesn't feel, and him also doesn't feel some type of way about it and i'm like okay i even miss him i just know in fact Nengi knows and I, i'm happy it ends after the music you get so that's just it and then guys erica just signed a new deal i don't know if i should call it a new deal but erica belongs to a new management team which is what i said after the whole cmc saga came that erica really needs a good management team if not at last she's not going to really reach like tasha you get so i just hope that this new management team that erica belongs to would really push her i don't know i think they are the ones also managing um lambo messi lambo like the winner of last year pepe dem gang you get messi i just hope that they will just help her repackage her rebrand her and just put her out there and not let the fire that is really burning and the kind of fans she has just go to waste like that has fans and she needs good management and i hope that these people that she has joined really help her to become or to be as in where we expect her to be because or more if you mess up with the whole platform or now when you just did the peak your story now sorry so guys now i want to talk about lekon lekon this particular one now is for lekon guys now let on the win this show. Let's not just argue. There is nothing. In fact, everybody campaigning for their person like Neil, like V, like Nengi, like Dorothy. For we, <laughs> you guys don't want to see how Lekon, how people campaign for Lekon. In fact, government don't follow the campaign for Lekon because in Ogun State you will see different like, like I don't. I, I, I see. see eh? It has never happened in the history of whether BB Africa, or BB Nigeria, or anyone. I've never seen this kind of love, and I'm wondering. This is pure grace like people literally old young middle-aged children everybody's just shouting lake on lake on and trust me if lake on no wind big brother will be in problem because 
I just feel like the way they are doing it, they are not, they are now the Lake on the icon fans, Lake on fans, they're not doing it like they want to win, they are doing it like they want to give others that social distance because each time Lake on is up for possible eviction, he claims like 40 percent, and the last one was 50 percent, like he lived. 50% for three people. So now this last set, I, I feel everybody went all out to just, you know, make sure that they give everybody social, like the other cost, contestants, social distancing. I don't see the magic. I don't see the juju. I don't see the miracle we go have to make another person win. But you never can say, but to me, with what I have seen and with the videos, I'm sure I will show you guys. Omo, na le kon de win the show. Where are my icons at? I don't say we don't try We gotta go to the finals You meant to win the prize D205 to not the court Put the corner the go We no fi give up now We no fi settle for less We no fi give up now We no fi settle for less to get serious Canopy somewhere say if you vote Lake on you chop Pamala. Like, hey, please, I would have loved to, I would have loved to see that kind of a place you get. If our government they can at least say vote to have a cara, okay. Lake on is now one of our government officials that votes to chop Pamala at this point. Ah, it is really massive, like different. I cannot even put the whole clip of people rallying and campaigning for. Lacon, like seriously, 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 the guy uh, is just an embodiment of grace, like an epitome of grace, as in no cap, no argument at this point. To me, now Lacon, they win the show. In fact, to you that is even watching it, whether you are an Engi fan, whether you are a, a Dorothy fan, V fan, Neo fan, in your heart of heart, inside one corner of your heart, you know, you are convinced that it's Lacon that is winning this show. So we are just waiting for tomorrow for us to just see them announce Lacon. And I can't even wait to see the surprise in his face because Lacon seems to be the most underrated housemate. I think in terms of stature, they come to believe in him, maybe based on his intelligence or his IQ, like mental attraction, so to say. <laughs> so that's just it. And he's been able to just make his way. Like the last diary section they had, I think Nengi and V said that Lekon will win the show. You get, and then you know, Neo is. I think Neo is still not believing it or not wanting to come to terms that somebody like Lekon can win the show because he said Nengi will be the one to win the show, and then Dorothy said Neo will be the one to win the show and all that. And I'm just like ego shokuna. 
na na shock you go shock them because every housemate that comes out of the house just seeing the whole people behind lake on they are just i'm sure they are shook like they are shocked and like wow are you serious because if they would ask them on the stage i'm sure the last person they will mention will be lake definitely but coming out the next day everybody's like it's lake it's lake because you've seen the massive crowd behind it anyway guys that's just what i came to gist you guys I should stay on a note in a lake but if you have an otherwise um, candidate, please leave it in the comment section. Leave your thoughts in your in the comment section. Give this video a thumbs up. Please, please, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed. Turn on your notification bell so that YouTube will inform you whenever I post a new video. And please check me out on my last lifestyle channel. The link is always in the description and pinned in the comment section. I will most definitely see you guys in my next one. Signing out, guys. Bye.